Scott Wzwyż Kobiet. Finał. Representing Italy. Reprezentantka Włoch. Alessia Tros. Reprezentantka Ukrainy. Yesterday was uh, decent, 7.81 coming in. Tobias Montler, one of the favourites, uh, best mark that we saw in qualifying, 8.18. Tentoglu, the Iranian indoor champion and outdoor indeed, might have gone further, but uh, he went for an early bath after a first time effort over the uh, all important eight metre mark. Lazar Anic we saw, and here's uh, Jacob Finch of Dukes, the first time that he's had daylight from eight metres in his career, eight metres eight recently. And then uh, Mazur of Ukraine, 8.07, his new best. And Holzner of Germany, another who's improved, just shy of uh, eight metres. Uh, next to come out, Gabriel Bitan of uh, Romania, added 18 centimetres to his overall PB in winning the Romanian title. It's a trick of the uh, national indoor titles, in fact. And Tentoglu, cool as you like, comes out with a swagger in the uh, Hellas Greece top. Time for some long jumping, I think. This is uh, Miltiades Tentoglu, European reigning champion, indoors and out, the Greek. The best of 8.38. Second in Levant to uh, Juan Miguel Echevarria. And uh, well over eight metres there, wow. So we're in the second round here. Tobias Motler, 8.18 in qualifying. Tentoglu, 8.04. And 8.04 is in fact what Motler's managed in the first round here. Astronomic down the, the runway and very good on the board. What is this measurement from Tentoglu? It's going to be close to his lifetime best. Overall, that is 8.38. Well, it's come up as 8.35. A new world lead for Miltiades Tentoglu and uh, well. That is an excellent shout for the gold medal already. It's Montler now who really has to push in order to challenge. Can he respond? Well, it was a very strong jump. The man with the best of uh, 8.22, Tobias Montler. who was uh, second to Tentoglu in Glasgow two years ago. National indoor record would have to be broken. That's uh, one held by uh, Michael Tornes of uh, Sweden. 8.30 if Montler was to challenge for that gold medal. Or to overhaul Tentoglu. He's challenging right now. Anic of uh, Serbia here. Look close on the board, it's just shy of uh, seven metres, of eight metres, I should say. So Anic, uh, lifetime best outdoors of 8.15, 7.98 his best indoors. Similar to uh, Tentoglu and uh, great on that board. there showing his takeoff Gabriel Bitter of Romania in the long jump now in which uh, Mirsadis Tantoglu has uh, really impressed here Dowie will have impressed his competition as well 8.35 this jump of 2021 Greek. It's a red flag for Bitter, who is yet to register a mark. And we are in this second round.
Mazur. Oh, but Ukraine has improved, by the way, by 14 centimetres to 7.89, as you can see there. As we head uh, to the long jump, so this is Tobias Montler standing in second place at this point. That fantastic 8.35 from Tentoglu. This man would have to break records to challenge. So uh, around that eight metre mark. green line is in fact the lead 835 the world lead and that well I said he'd have to break records to challenge he's done exactly that has Montler 831 he's broken the national indoor record of Michael Turner's great competitor over the years in the long jump and uh, recently retired in fact but uh, Montler has taken over the mantle and is now maybe to the surprise of Tentoglu only four centimeters away. So back to the long jump, Mazur. He's improved with every jump so far. And over eight meters in the third round. So we kick on with the fourth now. And that looks to be a possible improvement. So that green line in the sand is the uh, lead, and indeed the world lead, not only in this competition at the European Athletics Indoor Championships, 835 10 Toglu. Mazur will be battling for a medal. Can he get himself a, a new lifetime best? The Ukrainian comes in 8.07, so he's just two centimetres shy of it. And by the looks of things, he could well have jumped further than before indoors. 8.14 it is, so look at that series that Mazur is putting together. So we're heading back to the long jump and uh, this is Mazur, fantastic series that he put together to improve all the way along. This is his final jump now. The medal's out of his grasp. You can see the colours there on your screen, gold, silver, bronze, very close together in fact. So Mazur, best of 8.14, and that looks to remain his best as the competition is in the final round. Good on the board, though, and uh, once again, a terrific series that he has uh, put together. Just to interject, Alex, in case you think you're missing anything from the shot put, Thomas Stanek, with the gold confirmed, has passed his final attempt. But gold, indeed, does go to the Czech Republic. Thomas Stanek. 21.62. Thank you. Now, we've seen uh, Tentoglu, the world lead, 8.35. Montler, national record, 8.31 to challenge. And you know what? Tentoglu hasn't uh, jumped since that opening round. I think perhaps he thought no one would challenge. And once you've kind of toned down a couple of gears, difficult to pick back up again. National record for Finland in third place in the bronze from Christian Pulley, bringing a bit of a surprise there. But uh, the Swedes and the Finns very much on song in the face of challenging that incredible first round effort from Tentoglu. What has Montler got here? Last effort, and it's uh, no improvement there. But I think he did extremely well to break Michael Tornus's uh, national indoor record. Likewise, Christian Pulley see much of him but uh, he's beaten Eero Hapala's best 8-11 it was and I mentioned the other day that uh, Finland has such great uh, history in track and field that these days we don't see too many national records uh, they've been breaking them as sprint hurdles recently of course with the likes of Naziri who we hope to see tomorrow but uh, Montler getting very close to Tentoglu. Didn't think he was untouchable, the Greek, but it has been a really good men's long jump final here tonight. And uh, quite some distance back, you can see some of the other athletes there. Jacob Finch of Dukes came in with a personal best of 8.08. 7.79 is his uh, best effort. Holt, so he was closer to his best of 7.97, but uh, those top four have put in a stellar showing. Tentoglu, another European title for him. And Montler, 
come in knowing that he was capable of challenging. In the end, that's what he did, but uh, he was a little way off. The Greek who has reigned supreme in Europe in the last couple of years. Well, don't go anywhere. We've still got the men's 1500 meter final to come up, of course. Hope you're enjoying the coverage here on the first day of action, whetting the appetite for what's to come across the weekend. So Tentoglu, he only registered one mark in the end, but that was all it's needed. Eight, 35, a brilliant jump. of Finland there and alongside Monla. There are your three medalists from the 2021 European Athletics Indoor Championships. Well, it's no surprise, I think. That's the highest calibre long jump competition in the world this year without a doubt yes there's been some good competitions in the US as you might expect I think really that's the that's without doubt the best for depth three men over 820 in a competition yes as we see confirmation of the full results Tentoglu, Montler and uh, Pulley and just another Shout out really to Mazur for continually improving throughout the rounds. And we're going to see these three best jumps. So we didn't see much of Pulley, I said. So right on cue, this is his best jump. Another who improved almost right the way through. And very impressive to get out to 8.24, given the initial distance between Tentoglu and the rest of the proverbial chasing pack. The record he's beaten. Aero Hapala from 2013, set in Pori in Finland. And he's added 13 centimetres to that. The Finnish record outright is actually already held by Pulley. I think 8.27 that he set last year in Espoo. Pulling it out in the last round, you'd have to say. <laughs> I've been saving that one 